Oh, hey. There's a few things you didn't know about me. Friends was one of my favorite shows growing up. And um, even though you can't really tell it now, uh, one thing that I do carry over from the 90s is a little bit of a Rachel hairstyle. I've always had it, and um, I'm just a huge fan of that character. My go-to beauty product is Arbon Face Lotion. I'm obsessed with this product, and it gives my face a beautiful glow. I can do a few impressions. Nora Jones. I waited till I saw the sun. I don't know why I didn't come back. Elmo. Elmo, can you to the telephone? I don't think it was until fifth or sixth grade that I got my first guitar. My dad gave me this tiny little guitar with nylon strings. But it wasn't really until seventh grade that I wrote my first song. Uh, Tom broke up with me and I went into my basement and I started playing. You're still the only one and I'm just not over you yet. And my parents heard that and 13 years old and I came out with my first CD. My celebrity crush is Robert Downey Jr. Especially in the movie Chances Are. He was so handsome in that film. The most recent show I binge watched on my computer was Game of Thrones, but I usually like to watch that show with a pillow handy because there are some very scary moments. Lots of water is essential for healthy vocal cords, but when I'm not drinking water, I'm honestly drinking kombucha. Lots of probiotics, really healthy for the system. And when I'm at a party, usually my drink of choice is tequila. Salute! Tequila! I feel like Judy Garland in Meet Me in St. Louis. A few of my favorite musicals are Ragtime, Last Five Years, Miss Saigon, Elegies, and Hamilton. Christy Neversall is my favorite Broadway actress. When I saw her in Grey Gardens, it was like the sheer emotion coming out of her from scene to scene was like nothing I've ever seen in my entire life. My mantra in life has always been, I am light. When I was a young girl, my dad always used to teach me that no matter what obstacles come in your way, as long as you keep moving forward with hope and joy in your heart, anything is possible. Just like where I am right now. So I hope you guys come out to see Anastasia on Broadway and get to see the magic that is this beautiful show. Thank you.